So I should ask for a suggestion now? Yeah. Party Rock. I didn't ask yet, actually, you know. <laughs> I asked, should I ask for a suggestion? So I'm asking, should I? Yeah. I'm seeing a no here. <laughs> Only takes one. Can I ask why you're saying no? I think you don't know where you are. <laughs> okay, I'll ask one more time. Should I take a suggestion? Yeah. 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 Thank you for not saying no. Okay, what's the suggestion? Wow, people are excited. I heard, I heard like sprayed beef. <laughs> I think that was two different people. Someone said something else, someone said beef, and someone said probably onions, and someone said like pan, like that's like an ingredient. I'm sorry, I have to make some with beef, onions, a pan. Sprayed beef, okay. As a kid, as a kid, sprayed beef. As a kid, I love beef jerky, right? I was a big fan of beef jerky. It was so expensive. That's something they never under, never explained, the price of beef jerky. It's so fucking expensive. Even the Ronco food dehydrator used to advertise itself like, tired of paying out the ass for beef jerky. <laughs> Tired of getting fucking hammered every time you go to the gas station to buy dry beef? Are you fucking sick of paying these top dollar beef prices when you're already getting raped at the pump? This is my impression of Ronco. Are you freaking sick of getting fucked over the, every time you buy beef and gas? Cause you always get beef jerky at the gas station. I call it the jerky station where I get beef gas. So buy our dehydrator and you can get, you can dehydrate your own beef and have it save money. You just gotta add a lot of salt and liquid smoke. We're gonna put some liquid smoke on that. And that's how you used to make shredded beef as a kid. You just dry it up and shred it. Shredded beef, uh-huh. Or you can just actually cut it with a knife or something like that if you want to. Just dry beef, raw beef. Okay, another suggestion. Piercings. Uh, piercings. Had one. It's gone now. I uh, once got my ear pierced at Claire's in Tallahassee, Florida. When I was in college, I was like, you know what? My hair is really long, and I hate my dad, so <laughs> I'm going home for Thanksgiving for the first time. I'm going to have a fucking earring in. I didn't want an earring. I've never wanted an earring, but I know someone who did, definitely doesn't want me to have an earring. That's my dad. So I was like, I went to Claire's and got the fucking, you know, the little stud, a little gold stud. Had it for about five days. It was worth it. That's the thing I miss. That's what I hated about the pandemic was that you couldn't do stuff like that because you'd be scared like, oh, how'd you get COVID? Well, um... <laughs> I just, just had to get my ear pierced. <laughs> like, really? It's like, but where is it? It's like, oh, I took it out. It was just a joke piercing. <laughs> so that's how you died? It's like, yeah, I'm dead now. Because I got this thing. Actually, you probably would die from an infection at Claire's, more likely. <laughs> okay, moving on. What's next? Oh, that was, thought it was padded. Oh God, I just slammed my, do you see that? I just rolled like this, I thought it was a fucking padded stool, I'm so out of it. Just slammed my hand, I didn't hear anything anyone said. <laughs> ah! Ah! Oh, it was just a dream. Where were you? I don't know, but everyone was saying random words at me. They were being nice. Someone did say circumcision, though, which is just, you know what? Uh, I've been, uh, I've been in like, uh, what do you call those places? The, um, the area in the college, the quad. There's always some old guy who's like, we gotta stop circumcision. <laughs> and either like, well, it's too late, <laughs> or you're just not gonna. There's no like, that's the, that's a war that doesn't feel very good to fight. I think is warring against circumcision. Yeah. Kenny, okay, one more suggestion here. Traffic. Traffic. Fuck yeah. <laughs> I love traffic. I love traffic because I get bored really quick, obviously. 
and I uh, like to like fuck with people, but like in nice ways. I like to be like uh, seem like someone who's either like maybe dying at the wheel, kind of. Like you're just driving just erratic enough, and they pull up next to you. You act like you're like you're like out like this, and then you wake up you're like oh my god, and you do it to them, and they uh, that's you gotta have untinted windows for this stuff. It's a great thing to have. This is why I don't have tint. It's so you can just do stuff like that. But. Yeah, I freaking love traffic. That's all I have to say about it. I just, I'm glad that it's back. It feels good. <laughs> Something about it feels good to just be like, ah, I recognize this feeling of being pissed. It's a special kind of piss you can relax in. Okay. And you can piss yourself and relax. Because if you can't go anywhere, you're just like, well, I haven't, so just piss myself here. Turn the heated seat on early, let it get hot, then you piss yourself, and you won't even know you did it. Piss isn't that bad anyways, you know? It's just sweat that comes out your dick. There you go. I think that's the first time I've ever said that. And that's it. Come back, Jeremiah. <laughs>